Hey the berries, welcome to another EU West support game. We are on Diamond 2. Zero LP, I think. Very cool. And uh, we're playing with an Aphilios and we're up against a virus zona. So you can probably see why I took Nautilus. Bot lane is very immobile. The odds of me landing a hook are pretty high. The odds of getting a kill, on the other hand, I'm not sure, but I'm, we'll find out in the next few minutes, I guess. I mean, Iron Vade's pretty decent. I'm not in the brush. I got kicked out of the brush because someone's to jail. And I got a fat booty. Like, I keep going around with people. I think we should just go back. Hey, Virtual. I gotta say, I don't really notice the Nemi buffs. Yeah, the Nemi buffs, as I said in the video that I made the tier list, that they weren't going to be massive. Especially if you're in low ELO. I think everyone will have experienced the passive. The bubble, I did notice a little bit in terms of the bubble damage and helping push in the wave. I definitely noticed the slight damage increase, but apart from that, yeah, it's not it's not so fantastic. It's just a little bit, in it? A little bit. Not sure how crazy you want to go here, level one. You might try and go knots. Well, we land those apparently. That's a really good poke there onto the Sona. Aphelios took some damage, but he does have red weapon, which does heal him up a little bit. The enemy team are probably going to get level 2 here first. I'm trying to help a little bit here with my Reddit shields. Actually, we're okay. We're okay. Oh, well. Okay. Well, I've still got a Hex Tech Flash, but yeah, this Aphidus is way too low HP. Actually, yeah, I think it's... Hmm. I should have paid attention to his items. It's Giga Greedy. He went cold. You're playing with a hard engage uh, support that wants to try and make plays early. I don't think going call is the right move. You're just sacrificing yourself like too much stats to be sacrificed. Like any Varus respected it by going um, Doran's. Yeah, this is awkward. No, if I can't go in here. I should have used Ignite. My Ignite kills. Minions though? Okay, my Ignite would have killed. Gotta be careful of like a Varus Q now. Oh, you kidding me? Apparently gotta be careful of a Maokai here too. Are you serious? This Phileas has to push in lane hard. He has to try and punish these recalls that they're doing here. Let's see if I can try and get into mid here. It's a full HP Diana. I'm not expecting a kill, but no. 
This is too deep now, surely, right? Okay, that trade wasn't too bad, actually. Next zone is going to be here now. Hecarim's now here as a party. Hey, what happened to the card there from TF? No! <laughs> I'm dead. I'm just actually dead. If TF had flashed that whole time, I want to ask him, like, why did he wait to do that for such a long time? I can't believe you. I think he also tried to stun, um... Oh, no, guys, what are you doing? I think that already might be GG as the pre oh, okay. I think Varus is on his way, but... I've got... Okay, try and slow this Varus from coming in, maybe. No way, okay. What is going on? Okay, good job TF for recovering that, hitting 6 and stuff. But let's Aphilius farm bot lane for free now. This is a very stressful game. Aphilius is getting a couple of plates there too. I'm not enjoying myself in this one. I think if it is probably going to want to recall. I mean, Varus has no ulti. He used it earlier. It's still going to be a small window here. I'm not sure if we would win a fight though. Like they've managed to buy and Varus's items are kind of scary. Hey, OMG. Thank you for the 18 month through. So thank you. I don't want to fight. Varus ulti be coming off cooldown shortly. We, we, we can't take this fight. I'm actually just going to run up to top side. Maybe I can get there in time. Okay, nice. Okay. Phileos level 7. I'm going to take ages for me to get level 6 now. Woke up at the midday, spent the cannon and leave pretty much. That was just me being there just in case anything else carried on then. He's hitting the cannon, minion helps push in that wave just so that deny a bit more. Of Denia. Uh, Denia? <laughs> Diana. Uh, yeah, I, I don't really want to fight. It's another good potential outcome. Maokai's bot side. Okay. It's going to be their first dragon. Mm, do we want to push in this wave still? Got Relic Shield coming up in again soon, but not really soon. Oh, this is bad. This is not good at all. They killed it way too fast. Ah. Get out. 
Wait. Did I heal again? <laughs> yeah, we shouldn't have done that. I didn't want to do it. I remember saying it out loud, didn't I? I did not want to push in that wave again because they're just a dragon, but... I mean, that should be a kill. I wonder how much of this laning phase, though, is just because the if it just went Cole, level 1, instead of going like a Dorans to help with the engages going in. I do really feel like it was a Dorans diff. Probably no point in me being here. Not quite enough. There's a turret plate right there, though, for the TF to grab. If he can manage it. He's got it. Huge. Really, really huge, that. <laughs> nice. You think this whole game is just going to be based around TF? Things happening around where TF is? Uh, Varus killed Aphelios bot. Aphelios still hasn't completed his call yet. Um, I can't really commit to going on to this. Okay. Yeah, TF's completely out of mana. I can't go in. Hmm. Stressful game. Maybe lock it would be better, Rob, and then like an even shroud. Three people bot right now. Dinah's caught out. This should be another kill. Okay, well played. There's three people bot though. Okay, they're all upper side river. There's probably wards in our jungle here. Yeah, okay. Not feeling it necessarily brave enough to go for that control ward in the river. Go on, yellow, yellow hook. Um, yeah, he's dead. An ally has been slain. How's it going, Tom? Should be doing this, Herald. The bot lane's quite deep on that turret. And if Phileos isn't going to go down bot side to answer that. I guess we're just going to give up that tier 2. I mean, if they're still down there, we can maybe use Herald to get something significant. There's a dragon again in 10 seconds. I think we just have to give up the dragon. Let TF have that blue buff. Okay. 
or any tank in the turret. Okay, cool. The minions are about to run out. I'm a little bit surprised actually that Hecarim just didn't pop Herald straight away for that engage. Just get that turret down really quickly and then maybe pressure onto tier 2. I think Aphilius will die for that turret. I all messed up his ulti. Sign a flash. Okay, Hecarim's just running over people right now. He needs to be careful here though. I'm not fully sure about this. Okay. It's considering flashing there. If it just did get that turret. On the tier two top. It's going for it. It certainly doesn't have flash. I mean, this game is feeling is super. Uh, feels very bad to play, but um, um, I guess he didn't factor in cleanse. Oh, I wanted that kind of minion, but okay. Um, I think the Yurik could have interrupted that TP, maybe? If he does the, the cage on the edge, does it bounce him out? Um, what is going on right now? Oh, no. There's been a lot of YOLO plays this last minute. Couple of head scratches. Gonna go like Bramble. Mitigate some of the Sona's healing. Another dragon in one minute. Markai might be in trouble. Okay. I mean, we can get a lot of stuff down here. Apart from minions from my Reddit shield, that's just not going to happen this game, apparently. <laughs> Do we still want to be around here? I'm not sure. But that's all their tier 2 turrets. Damn, we've done a good job on turrets. We just haven't done a good job at neutral objectives. Thirty seconds until dragon. It's gonna put this control ward here and it's gonna recall real quick. Need wads. Shouldn't take me too long to get back down again. 
but I'm more worried about the Zephidios and the Sekrum are fighting over jungle mobs right now. The Zephidios is like baby raging. I swear like every single AD carry I've had today has had issues. I guess you kind of have to have issues if you're an AD carry main, but no, that's not the point. <laughs> Let me get the kind of minion. Look at me contributing. I saved TF's life with the locket. Go me. Woo. There's literally nothing for me to do here, really. I was just waiting here just in case Maokai's first thought was just a flash away, if he had flash. Can potentially look at them, Baron, but I mean, I don't know. I don't think we're ready for Baron right now. Now well, it's not the time. People aren't in position properly. Hecarim's literally waiting in base for 75 gold because of Phileas. He's mad because of Phileas has stolen his jungle. Twisted Fate died. May I have a minion, sir? Pog? Shut down. Are they on Baron? No. Okay. Hecarim's thinking about going in, but... Don't really know what to do. Just have to wait. There's no easy objective left on the map. It's Baron or Tier 3 uh, Towers. I would... At this point, you're kind of looking at Baron, but it's... Team's been kind of ass in that regard. TF ported behind the Varus. I I don't know why he would do that. Okay, he gets a one for one, but he's more than that. He's worth us. He's worth to us like two people. Not he doesn't need to do one for one trades. And if Ilios isn't playing with the team, he's not going Baron. So, um, um, what are you doing, guy? Okay, well I'm gonna probably die here now. No way. No way. What? <laughs> I don't... I don't know. Okay, if it managed to actually kill the Varus 1v1. I don't know what's going on. This isn't a place for me. I don't recognize this this game. I don't recognize this game mode. Mad. A little bit, yeah. Thank you, Libra. Thank you for the nine month three subway. Baron got done. Who did Baron? They did Baron. Yeah, the enemy team did their Baron. I guess it was during the whole Diana stuff. Wasn't even paying attention. I've lost all track of what's happening. 
Okay, let's say I just... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on, nuts? Can you upgrade my locket pretty please, sir? Thanks, man. Well, I guess I'm just dead. I mean... I don't know how to play like this. <laughs> like, in this situation, I legit don't know what to do. Because everyone is just piling in, like, one by one by one. I have, like... I'm at the mercy at stuff like the Hecarim, just doing stuff like that. Like, I want to play team play, but team's like, nah, just whatever. <laughs> Arena deathmatch mode. Play with your team? I mean, I would love to... I would love to do that. I really would. It's not really a team at this point, though. can't path around these minions. I literally can't. I can't melee the- What? Where is the game sending me? I right clicked the Nexus, man. <laughs> I was so close to the Nexus that the game decided to send me like spaghetti junction all the way around. It's like I missed my turning when coming off the motorway, so I had to go all the way around. Oh my god. Alright, no one gets none of that game. That was so horrible to play. Yeah, I don't know. I do wonder how much of that lane phase is just because the Aphidios won't greed Cole with a Nautilus engage as opposed to a Doran's. I don't understand why you would do that. I bet he just added me as well. I bet he just added me. Oh, he did, guys! He added me! What's he got to say? Let's be his therapist for for the minute. Go on, then. Alright. What does the therapist say? Uh, I've never had one. What, what do we... How, how, do, how do we approach this conversation? How does that make you feel? He's either not going to say anything, or he's going to put like a 10 page uh, autobiography. I don't understand people like this, because it's like, they're toxic enough in the game. They're toxic enough to add, but they're not toxic enough to then say anything after adding. Do they, they, do they not usually, do they get to this stage usually and people don't accept? Is this guy now stun locked? I think we broke him. Can I? Can you explain? Uh, now I'm stun locked. What am I meant to explain? The meaning of life. The meaning of life. <laughs> What 
Why am I forced to lay in 1v2 for no reason? Uh, Rewatch the game in VOD. I think that might have to, that might explain a couple of things. Um, but yeah, this is probably going to enter into bad territory, so I'm just going to put a block. Um, but yeah, he feels it okay to spam bait pings on me, which is, you know, obviously the KYS ping. Uh, I think I've already done the report on him in game. But yeah, I mean, I didn't want to lane with him after the things that he was doing in lane. And I think I did the right thing anyway, because I roamed mid, helped that mid a lot, and, you know... TF in the end basically carried the game for the majority of it. There were some weird ulties for sure. There are some weird plays. I mean, at least when he ulted in, he got like a one for one some of the times. But generally, for the most part, TF with the Hecarim kind of carried the game. If he just had a mental breakdown. It wasn't even just like a mental breakdown with me. He was also trolling his jungler as well, but taking all the CS and taking CS away from, from TF. Um, so he's definitely got issues. Um, he's looking for... That vent out, isn't he? But whatever.